it's bobby and welcome to bobby moore's channel let's talk about crypto again guys are you ready to hear about the new hidden gem the gem is here bro let's go today's gem is called charity dow Charity DAO is based on EVM and implemented using Solidity. Its initial offering will be based on the Binance Smart Chain ecosystem and will support cross-chain implementations of Ethereum, Polygon, and Avalanche among others in the future. Charity DAO is governed by a decentralized autonomous organization and it has reserved a migration module for the future upgrades. The core modules of the contract include Treasury, responsible for asset deposit and CHD output, public donation pool, responsible for transferring funds out of the pool, for the use by the DAO's governance decisions, direct donation pool, responsible for accepting funds directly donated by the public and transferring them for use according to the rules, charities, responsible for launching charities that accept cryptocurrency donations on the chain, charity certificate NFT, responsible for generating NFT certificates for DAO members to record charity behaviors. Donors are the starting point of the charity DAO organization. By donating cryptocurrencies such as BNB, they receive CHD tokens, participate in the governance of the DAO and get the dividends of CHD. Treasure the treasurer will accept BNB donated by donors and produce the corresponding amount of CHD tokens according to the mining algorithm. 80% of CHD will become rewards for the donors and the remaining 20% will be put to the public donation pool. And 95% of the BNB in the treasury will be used to maintain the value and liquidity of CHD and 5% of the BNB will be used for rewarding volunteers and occasional airdrops of the DAO. Public donation pool. For the CHD in the public donation pool, DAO will vote to decide who will receive the donation of 20% of the total existing CHD in the pool and get NFT of their donation certificate given by the corresponding organization or it can choose not to donate the CHD and destroy half of the 20% CHD and distribute half of them to the DAO organization with the NFT recording this selfish behavior. Direct donation pool. If donors do not want to join the economic system of the treasury, they can donate to the direct donation pool after noting the donation target or usage of the donated BNB. 90% of the coins will be donated directly to the target and 10% will be put into the treasury to attract more people to generate charitable giving ideas. If the donor has not noted any donation target or usage, all the donated amounts will be put into the treasury. Charities. They will contact the world's well-known charities devoted to humanitarian reliefs and include them in the charity pool to be launched on chain later on. The donations can be locked through smart contracts. Volunteers. They will seek volunteers with shared philanthropic goals worldwide to participate in the organization's publicity and fundraising. They will contract charities to be listed in the pool and launched on chain to participate in the governance of DAO. Gatekeepers. Charity DAO cannot be built overnight and needs to go through several stages of development. Before the DAO can complete all the governance work through the contract, the gatekeepers will undertake some of the responsibilities and the credit will be built through public announcement and on-chain data. The DAO functions are fully built. All gatekeepers' responsibilities will be shifted to the DAO governance system. In the planning of the charity DAO, proposals can be initiated by CHD holding users. Such proposals can be donated to the target persons of the CHD in the public donation pool or about optimization and adjustment of the whole charity DAO mechanisms and ecosystem. At this stage, proposals are initiated by the gatekeepers with opinions from the entire community and as the DAO becomes more stable, the proposal responsibility is transferred to the DAO. When the treasury exchange ratio is lower than the market exchange ratio, donors will choose to obtain CHD by donating to the treasury. As donations increase and more CHD flow into the market, the treasury exchange ratio will be higher than the market exchange ratio. Then a proposal will be initiated through the DAO to determine the timing and amount among the 95% BNB into the treasury to enter the market to make the treasury exchange rate lower than the market exchange ratio. Thus DAO will initiate the next stage of the cycle. Ecosystem development. NFTs made from donation certificates issued by charities have a limited amount and collection value and thus can add vitality to the original ecosystem. The portion from the direct donation pool that flows into the treasury in turn keeps the treasury running. Moreover, Planned functions for the later stage can also promote the development of the ecosystem and thus motivate people to donate. The project also has its own roadmap. This is a very important factor. Roadmap usually means the great professionalism of the team and that the team has a clear plan for the development of its project. Their plans go far into the future. The project team is always attentive to your questions and is ready to share with the future plans for the development of the project. Of course, also marketing. The project has a very active Telegram chat with 29,000 participants. I know that when you join this community, people who are not 
on the team will help you find answers to all your questions. Guys, Bobby here. We're talking about crypto for a long time. I know you are very smart guys and could make the right decision about investing in this project or not and will be able to make the right decision about investing in this project. You know that on this channel, I do reviews only for those projects in which I am personally interested. This project is interesting to me. Well, that's it for today. Bobby's in touch. Until the next video, bro.